Okay, so we're reacting to the Best of Bundy Shoe Store customers. Best of Married. I got a wall bundy. I think with kids. Oh, yeah, Best of Married with Kids Shoe Store customers. Exciting. Sure to be exciting. Ooh, bundy! With children. Remember me, Bundy? No. The one you insulted? I'm sorry, ma'am. You'll have to be a little more specific. <laughs> you made fun of my weight. You called me a giant seal. Well, let's see. I had four elephants. I had a <laughs> rhino who wanted some flip-flops. Had a manatee. <laughs> no, no, don't remember any seals. Can you jog my memory? You know what jog is. That's what you do when the ice cream truck is pulling out. With this attitude, wow. you're going to be working here for the rest of your life. <laughs> Well, take a gander into the seat next to you if you want to see what your future looks like. <laughs> That's messed Come, up, dude. Penelope. Let's go someplace where they treat us with respect. Uh, try the moon. You'll weigh less now. <laughs> now, I demand equal time. Fuck, dude. Speaking of equal, you really ought to try some. <laughs> Is this just a full, like, fat once, person compilation? Split at the sides. <laughs> well, let me explain. See, it's, it's just like an elevator. There's a two-ton weight limit on this ship. <laughs> two tons? Where do you think you're going? Aren't you open? Sorry, ma'am, but unlike your mouth, we occasionally close. <laughs> Damn. Who is this guy? He doesn't give a fuck. Okay, Enid, work with me here. Pull it in. Pull in your talons. We're almost there. The 90s was a different time. <sighs> See? I told you I was a four. No, ma'am. Four is what you'll have to yell when the shoe pops off your foot. Uh, Excuse me, but am I invisible? Possibly from Pluto. <laughs> We're leaving. I want a blue. You've already got one. <laughs> Give me the shoe. <laughs> Hold on. Break. <laughs> it's so accurate, Excuse though. Me. So many people are like, do oh, it's not my shoe size. In my size. Like, just yes, I do, size but up. the Society for the Prevention of Cruelty to Shoes would not allow me to sell them. <laughs> Well, I hope you get coal in your stocking on Christmas morning. And I hope you get slim fast in yours. <laughs> oh, it's good. Now we're about good. to have How much our Christmas use? party here, so would you mind eggnogging on out? <laughs> Do you want us to gag you? You're already doing that, but I would like to be blindfolded. <laughs> you can't compete with my charm. I'm a natural-born salesman. Excuse me. Hey, do I come to the hag shop bother you when you're working? <laughs> I'm gonna go out on a limb here. You've never been employee of the month, have you? That's right. But if I were you, I wouldn't be going out on any limbs. <laughs> we're trying to teach this man that his behavior towards us is unacceptable. But a better use of time would be to teach each other the words, no thank you, I'm full. <laughs> what size am I? Well, I'm no expert, but from where I sit, I'd say, too big for shoes. <laughs> well, I'm not sure I like this shade of blue. I'll tell you what I'll do then. We'll stand you in front of a mirror. I'll begin strangling you. When you reach the shade of blue that is satisfactory to you, you yell, moo, and I'll stop. I want my that feels like a great stopping point. This is all super silly and hilarious. I get that it's like 90s sitcom stuff. <laughs> Very interesting. Uh, I never saw this show. Maybe I should see it. Ed O'Neill, is that who this is? Yeah. That's, he's, he's a riot. <laughs> Good stuff.